the crazy emulation we back at it with another ROG video this is Kossu's 2k8 running on an RPC S3 um, running at 18 watts game ran flawless ran really good um, you also me play a full-blown half hope you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see y'all then Saints square up against the Albany Great Dames. We're really excited for you this way. The Saints win the tip off and the game is underway. Passes it to the strike. Whaley takes it up, gets the second chance basket to go. He's got two. Samuel fires it way up court from 12 to the right. To now by Woodard. Augustine goes up, plays it right in. And they're up by four. Lindsay backs in. Crosses it up. It goes straight out of bounds after the shot. Whaley inbounds the ball. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Tracy Wilson, who has some info for us. Thanks, Vern. A little while ago, I talked with the great Danes coach. He told me that the speed of the team on the other end of the court is a huge concern. He said we have no excuses tonight. They have such great team speed that if we don't hustle back on defense on every trip, they'll be shooting layups on us all game. Thank you, Tracy. Last layup was missed by Lewandowski. The D really did his job there to make him change the shot. Last play up to Mark by Augustine. Last shot made in by Felder. That's why coaches want you to hit the glass when the shot is released. Good things happen when you keep that pressure on. Aaron last shot by Wolaskowski. The Great Danes will try to put a stop to this one. McCollum jams it in. But they're still behind by eight. Throws it up, he is the jump shot. And they're now behind by six. Woodard catches it, right wing. Finishes in close. They're ahead, 12 to four. Leads him with the pass. Good job on the layup by Lindsay. They cut it to six. Wallace Kowski passes it up court. Wheeler gets it up, knocks it down from 11 feet. They extend the lead to eight. Samuels, nice little crossover. Dishes out left. Riggs shoots it. Lindsay pulls it in. Lindsay didn't get that rebound by accident. He knew right where to be.
pulls the trigger. The three is drained by Felder. And they now go up by 11. McCollum from the wing. Wheeler pulls it in. Puts three. And it's scooped up by Lewandowski. The steal by Augustine. Up ahead, Felder lays it right in. They got on this roll a while ago and just haven't looked back. Has it outright to put an end to the run? Hold in by Felder. Well, you can't afford to spot the other team any more points, Vern. They're in danger of letting this game be over before the second half. The Great Danes will take their first time out. Well, let's get back to the action. The Great Danes will bring out some reserves. Foster inbounds the ball. Under seven minutes left in the half. It looks like they're playing man to man. Uses the crossover. Lewandowski dishes it to the top of the key. Foster releases. It's right rim and doesn't fall. Their rebounding has been terrific, Vernon. And that's the main reason they're leading in this game. Augustine gets the lay-in. He's got four. Albany has had serious problems with their interior defense. And Tracy has a report from their bench. The great Danes coach just told the players on his bench, we have to be more physical in the paint. Don't be afraid of some contact. Sounds like he'd rather have some fouls called than to keep giving up all those easy baskets. All right, Tracy, let's it go. Collected inside by Samuels. The great Danes will try to end this run. Lewandowski picks it up. Wheeler hauls it in. That's his third rebound of the contest. Lewandowski is in a pretty cold stretch right now, Vern. And there's a danger that it's going to start to rub off on the rest of the team. To the elbow. The finger roll was laid in by Lewandowski. But they still trail by 18. Passes to the baseline. Hangs in the air. The layup was tossed in by Woodard. By 20. Foster inbounds the ball. Just over five minutes left in the half. Riggs from deep. Wheeler pulls it down. The team wasn't too worried about that one. Gave him room to get it off. Mainly because they preferred the long three over him driving it in. Albany is really struggling. Samuels throws it out. Pulls up. They're now behind by 20. The Saints take their first time out of the game. They're getting set to inbound the ball. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. Hooked away, but it's retrieved by Foxley. Felder catches it, top of the key. The crossover with the shot. Got it from the left block. They lead 32 to 10. Passes perimeter. Seabrand. Felder gets the rebound. That's another rebound for a team that's doing a great job on the boards. They've got a big edge there today. Fires the three. Collected by Seabrand. But they're still out in front by 22. Seabrand from long range. Moreno snatches it down inside. What a good job on the defense to make him think about that shot. Left wing raises up. Wide open shot. Missed by Felder. But they still lead by 22. Samuel, his first shot of the game. Wheeler gets the board inside. Albany has been on the losing end of the rebound battle. And Tracy is near their bench with a report. The great Danes coach just told his assistants if we have to defend with five guys in the paint, we must do it. But I'm getting very tired of seeing us getting killed on the boards. That's something screaming to the chalkboard then. Thanks, Tracy. Both teams will make some substitutions. Gets the second to fall as well. 
the great days of all time. Well, it looks like they're getting set to inbound the ball. Foster inbounds the ball. About three and a half minutes left in the half. Bounces it to the left wing. Lindsay takes the shot. Puts too much on. That's the shot you look for, Bill, even though he's not their number one option. The defense will have to show him some respect because he will hit that given another chance. The Great Danes need to find some answers here. It's deflected. The Great Danes will retain possession. Oh, what a good deflection. He didn't get the steal, but he's still disrupting the offense. What a pass. Foster backs him down, dishes to the left side. Snatches the offensive rebound. Knocked loose. And it's gathered up by Wenty. The D was really waiting for him there. That's how you do it. Keep the heat on. Wait for the mistake. And then keep the balls. The opening coach doesn't look happy. He's going to try and turn things around with this timeout. Well, let's get back to the action. The Great Danes are going to make some substitutions. Plus one, inbounds the ball. 250 left in the first half. Goes up. Snatched by Lurley. There was too much defensive pressure on him to take it to the tin with ease. Boxley puts it up and hits the quick shot. They're now out in front by 30. Picks it up. Chad by Minow. He's got two. Foxley tosses it up court. Feeds right wing. Shoots it. Knocks it down. It's a free throw play. He's one for two from deep. McCollum. Minow shoots a three. Bay corrals the miss inside. Gets it outside. Sandler passes it to the wing. Unloads. The offensive board gathered by Minow. Samuel grabs the rebound and flips it ahead. That last basket was buried quite bad. Foxwood inbounds the ball. Lurley goes up, slides in with a soft finger roll. By 31, they're set up in Minamet. Leads him with the pass. Minow flips it in for two. But they're still behind by 29. Right side, shoots from the post, not there, by Moreno, but they're still up by 29, plus one, crosses it over, Samuel, plus one, catches it, out left, dish, high post, Bay puts it up, Moore, yanks it down inside, Samuel. Beyond the arc. Buried by McCullough. They now trail by 26. It's like a library here, Vern. We need some excitement to get this crowd going. Has it. Right wing. Good box out. And the board picked up by Minow. 30 seconds left in the first half. Terrific job clearing some space under the glass. Physicality prevailing. Passes to the top of the key. Bay shoots. Minow snatches down the offensive board. He just couldn't overcome the good interior defense right there. Hoswald is tagged with the reach, and that's his first foul of the game. Oh, you can't come across the body like that. That is a textbook reach. Foxler inbounds the ball. The Saints turn this one over out of bounds. Sometimes a pass like that can be the fault of the guy in receiving it. Not that time. That was just a bad look. Lindsay. Lewin Dassel calls in the board. Crosses it up. It would have counted, but the buzzer beater was missed by Riggs. And we're headed to halftime. With the score, 
All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave me a like and subscribe. And as always, leave me questions, and I'll see y'all in the next one.